Now we are going to take a look at Privilege Session Manager, PSM. If you look at the architecture, we already installed the vault. That's the first one. It's a part of the member group. And we have Active Directory, one more VM, Cyber PVWA, Password Vault Web Access. Now what we are going to do is PS, we are going to install the PSM, which will be part of the Active Directory. In this environment, except the vault, everything will be part of the Active Directory. Vault will be only standalone, hardened Windows, a workgroup environment. A PSM server is mainly used as a jump server or isolate the uh, operations and also help us to monitor the privilege accounts activity and the record the sessions that going through the PSM server. I have installed, um, this is the host name, and still part of the work group, I'm going to join to the domain. How I can join to the domain, I can go here, and the domain name going to be Jeffrey, and the domain administrator, the domain administrator password is joined to the domain now welcome to because it's part of the active directory active directory name is uh, my active directory environment is jeffrey dot lcl and putting the password i want to show something before we install the psm I have already logged into the PWA, which is a password vault web access. If you look at the PWA, I have PWA and CPM. I don't see the PSM here because we didn't install. Now I'm going to go, the pre-request has to be installed. Install automation. If you go to the pre-request, you will see the file pre-request.config. This file is very, very important. Four items will be installed. One, I to copy this path. I will go here. I will go to the PowerShell. Go to the PowerShell administration. Run the PowerShell using this particular co command. And copy that and run it. It will install the pre-request requirements. The path is very, very important. So the machine is getting restarted. I already have a screen set here. So we will see the CyberArk uh, PSM reinstalled through the console I'm watching also. After we install the PSM, it takes a lot of time to come back. So just give enough time for the system to get the update everything. So I'm going to log in as administrator into the continuous to install. Now it's process installing RDS is getting installed. Okay, so everything is installed. You can see the .NET is installed, RDS, and NNLA is configured, and RDS security layer is installed. Let me log into the RDP, so we'll have a better and a bigger screen. So we pre-request is installed, so we are going to go and see the installation of PSM now. So I'm going to go here, software, request, right mouse key, run as administrator. We'll install the C++ packages. Okay, we go to the next, welcome. Yes, of course, version 11.2. Next, the username and company name is mistakejeffrey.com. The privilege PSM manager will be installed under the CyberArk on that particular VM. 
or the recording will be in, uh, recorded and saved here or you can change the folder where you want to change it this is the uh, safe name is going to be pwa config of course now this is the vault ip address if i go back to my architecture architecture is the vault ip address is this vault is the core of every single thing we are doing security wise a famous port number 1858 and the vault password it's not the domain password it's a vault password we will skip this one okay now here is the username there's a first username for psm app i'm going to say app uh, user for an example okay done two users created and uh, restarting the computer now let's restart this is the console view of the system. I'm going to look at the services there should be a two services should be started cyber arc credential manager cyber arc privilege session manager here so this service is started what i'm going to do is i'm going to log in with the pwa server and see anything is come up so it's no changes here so far session expired i'm going to log in I'm logging into the PBWA to see whether any changes took place. See the PSM appeared there. If I go and take a look at it, yep. We already have a PSM. We have successfully installed the PSM. Thank you.